modest lifestyle welcome back to the channel it's a reaction video who made it to the top of course you and i were here we're back like we never left lazy people everywhere quick reminder if you love me i love you back simple i love you with what i love you mm -mm -mm -mm. Backpackers everywhere, lazy people. And where is my backpacker? Of course, one leg. We are very much around London. We made it to London. <laughs> Another leg is in Silicon Valley of Africa, aka Iyabohanze, aka Kenge Wood. We died there, of course. <laughs> we are landlords here. You get what I mean? Coco of the Most High, the Blessed One, the Modest Nation. You guys are too much. Yo. Hey! If you, you've got no idea what your presence means to Coco Mama because as it is now, the street is very, very hot. View is refusing to view. YT, we don't know what is going on. Eh? YT recommendation is going everywhere. YT, you know they help us push our content out anymore. We don't know. Eh? What is wrong with this Mr. Aguiridim? Mr. Aguiridim, take it easy now. What is this? I'm not the only one complaining. No, Oga Michele Ponte, Michele Ponte was complaining that Whitey disabled his comment section. How is he going to interact with his people? Hey, I said, wow, from no view Wahala to no interaction Wahala. Hey, this one is get as he be, he be as he get. This one get K leg. That's why we appreciate you all here. Your presence alone, our returning thing. Without you guys, <laughs> without you guys, what, what, what would I be doing here? But because of you guys, no leave, no transfer. Because of you guys, as you are coming, we are leaving. We are leaving that we never left thing. A quick reminder, if you love me, I love you. You know what I mean? <laughs> hey! On a more serious note, I don't wanna. <laughs> On a more serious note, I don't want. I don't want. Leave me alone in my small corner. Let me just stay in your mansion and be mansion. I'm not in Kilimani. <laughs> Some hey. people are living in Kilimani, paying heavily. They can't even buy a packet of chicken to give to their sister. Your sister, you left your son, your breastfeeding son, with your sister. She took care of your baby for how many days? How many days did Sean spend? in Jamaica. Now you're making this Jamaica dish. Huh? And you don't want your sister to try it out. Your friend got her own plate. Your Nigerian boyfriend got his own plate. Your baby got his own plate. Where is your sister's plate, Sean? Coco Mama, have you ushered your people in? Grab whatever that is grabbing. Go and borrow of water here. Drop your sharp sharp. You guys, Coco Mama of the Most High, we are here. In fact, there's no point to bring in anybody. Sean made it again. Guys, Sean came for me. How do I know? I know. <laughs> you don't know that big fishes, they use fake accounts to reply. <laughs> you will be thinking, hear me. Oh, I love Sean. No matter what you say about her, whether in a negative or in a positive way, you will never hear her reply to any reaction channel. Nine, I retrieve what I have said. She replies. She uses fake account to reply. This one I know for sure. I ask her. I say, Sean, is this you? She even came back to come and explain more. Whenever you see someone putting extra energy to tell you or to prove to you that whatever you are saying is not true, then there's something there. You can't tell me nothing. We've seen Sean flying to Dubai, Nigeria, South Africa, UK, name it. Why are you saying name it? Eh? Travel commando will tell you that he has been to 70 countries. So you can't just mention five countries. UK, South Africa, Nigeria, where else? Dubai. You mentioned four countries and you are telling me name it. Sean, you can do better. Okay? Was she using the person's passport? Those countries that she has been to, how many are they? And how many times did she visit those countries? And how many copies does her international passport has? For me, 
in my country we have 32 copies and we have 62 copies if you are a frequent flyer let's say you are in and out you're a business person you're always in dubai you are always in china you are always in malaysia you know you are a business person you are into buying and selling who knows <laughs> even though that kind of buying and selling you get what i mean leave me alone let me be saying it mm. if you're that kind of a person you would be advised by your immigration to take 64 copies so that you don't have this issue of your passport copies getting exhausted yani you finishing everything because of the stamping but this in this case like you go to her channel she hasn't traveled that much okay even if you have been to 10 countries how many times did you visit those 10 countries oh i've been here oh i've been there i'm so freaking what and since you know the magic of hitting a million subscribers overnight like sean did on tiktok why don't you apply the same magic instead of struggling peddling cheap lies for views why are you giving me attention when you know that i'm peddling and struggling with lies huh why what are you doing here sean you can do better Anyway, Sean Arrow official is here. Me, I like ginger like this. <laughs> if these people, they know me. They know that I like when you come for me. When you come for me, I will stuff it in. Then I will load it for you. Baby, if you give it to me, hey. <laughs> I don't like stuff like this. I did not insult her. I just simply said, don't live fake life. You and I, we know okay that if you are an immigrant there are procedures there are process to it you come one year ago complaining about not getting a visa and then all of a sudden you are acting oh i expected my husband to come and then my husband is in nairobi and then da, 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 da. we can't see something like that. as a reactor mm -mm 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 -mm. once you give me a hint like this and once you come trying to defend yourself <laughs> i put my head in big time that is when i will come with full force and that's why we are going to react on her video 11 months ago she claimed that her husband surprised her with a car the way they blow the plate number of the car <laughs> hey who did you borrow this car from sean oh i don't know how to drive you're gonna make me drive overnight thank you so much babe where's your car where's the car that your husband surprised you with you are not even a resident of a country, Yani. People that live in the UK, people that have lived there for 20 years, they don't brag like this. They don't show us like this. They know the procedure. Even if your husband is a rich kid, let's say that, okay, he's a student, but he's a rich kid. Huh? They know the procedure of buying a car in the UK. The way you did it. Huh? <laughs> Guys, let's start from there. Let's watch her. Then follow my dreams. Let's see it. The man that would have been pressing. Where is the key? Here. Okay, I'm gonna come right there. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me see. <laughs> Damn. Damn. But what? Damn, it's so beautiful. Maybe sure. help me switch off that radio or reduce the volume a little. Mm -hmm. But, baby, honestly, thank you. Thank you. You like it? Yeah. So you have to like check now mm, all those two top. Okay, online, right? Mm, they used to be busy going like they used to like fully booked. Fully okay. Occupied. Yeah, but I know you. You, you to, can't like, teach me. You have to. I can teach you. Actually. No, because but you, but you see, mm, you see, so the thing, but their own is. Like they are the one that I need to teach you that you can move around there and show you. Yeah, you know why I say you, you can't too, teach I me. Know, I don't know the road like. No, it. you know why I say you can't teach me. Mm. It's because you would want me to start driving like tomorrow. Enough of this, uh, Kenjawood, UK branch. Enough of this 
this one. What is going on here? Oh, uh, I can teach you, but if I teach you, I'm going to make you drive overnight. Oh, again, you are saying bad. Oh, this one. Fake, 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 fakery. She was even faking her accent. Like, Yanni, 11 months ago, the way she was speaking here is not actually the way she speaks now on her recent vlogs. Guys, she made Jamaican dish, okay? <laughs> and I, I played... I, I, I relaxed. Someone actually elected me to this video, her recent video. I'm looking, I'm looking. Ten chicken legs. Not chicken legs, chicken thighs. Chicken legs is uh, run away. <laughs> Ten chicken thighs. This girl cannot give even her sister one piece. Her sister had to collect from her son's plate. Actually, it was her boyfriend that was handing in her son's chicken from her son's plate, okay, to Sean's sister. Her husband could not bear it. Her husband was covering, again, when she joined on the table, she started complaining, oh, where are the chickens? I thought I left a lot of chicken on this plate. Where are those chickens? Her friend got her own plate. Her husband or boyfriend or man friend got his own plate. Her baby got his own plate, but your own sister that took care of your baby. You could not serve her a plate. You could not make her her, her own plate. Guys, have you ever seen anything like this? Look at where she is now. She's, you can see that she's staying in a very, very expensive apartment. She has to work her ass off to pay for this kind of place she's staying. You can tell. Kilimani. Of course, Kil Kilimani. It's a very, very expensive neighborhood. Nobody needs to tell me. Let's watch them. This is the height of it. How much is a packet of chicken? At least she's making good amount of money here on YT. How much is a packet of chicken? You cannot buy extra packet of chicken. Making this special delicacy. Your sister had to collect from your son's plate. And even collecting from your friend's plate. On top of it, you are complaining. Huh? Sean, why are you so mean like this? Who did this to you? Your own sister. You cannot feed your own sister. Your, your own sister that you, you... The worst part of it is she's even making money <laughs> using her sister. She did a video where she claimed that she rushed her same sister for emergency. And that video is over 100k. Can you imagine how much she has made on that video? So you, from that video, you cannot even treat her I feel sorry for this girl. There's something else that happened, okay? When they were surprising her when she was coming back from the UK, she wasn't even in the UK. She was just on transit through the UK airport, okay? While she was coming, her sister was vlogging. The first thing her sister said, and it caught my attention, but I didn't want to say much about it. She said, oh, today we will be eating good. Today we will be eating good. Meaning that some days, <laughs> hey, some people, some people can pretend. Some people can fake this life. Some people can even fake what they eat. Okay? What they eat in front of camera is not actually what they eat behind. Probably after showing you, oh, them eating, going there, cooking this, cooking that, the next minute they are starving. Or whoever that is around them will really struggle. Just for them to keep up with this kind standard of life. I don't get it. Let's watch her. Ah. Hey, delicious. Jamaican chicken. Yeah, it's called jack chicken. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Enjoy the 
Hey, Papa. 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 She does slide like this so I can feed the boy as well. Ah, ah the chicken has disappeared. <laughs> I thought I left like a lot of chicken here. Oh, mom. This chicken. Apple. Apple. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm? Papa, can you see Papa I mean? He's destroying the chicken. Mm hmm? That's for tops. You understand, like chicken yeah. where you don't go and leave mm. the bone. Right? Mm. I've never had rice mixed with beans together. <laughs> That's chicken one. By the way, it's true as we don't mix the rice, I told you. Mm. Yeah, true. Am I seeing double? Where is your sister's plate? Why can't she see that this is so sensitive, that this is somehow... Her sister ate a lot, actually. Her sister ate more than anybody. Her sister was grabbing from her son's plate, grabbing from her friend's place, okay? Her friend, she invited her friend over for this content. And of course, you can see her husband all dressed up in Nigerian attire with their baby, just for this surprise, for this content. And her sister again, where is her plate? Oh no! Stingy, 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 even to your own sister. Who is so nice? Who is there for you, looking after your baby? Why you are faking your ass off? When is she moving? Bring it on me. Hey, I don't run away from things like this. I don't, you see, I don't look for trouble, but I don't run away from trouble. Go and ask Baba Marwa. You can even come with your real face. Anything I see here I will react. I can pick stuff from comment section. I can react. I can grab anything. So long as it's not something of private, something that, let's say, something that somebody did not bring to public. But if it's something that you have shared here, did you claim that your husband bought a car for you? Yes. Are you acting like you are something in the UK? Of course, yes. Someone dropped a comment that was like, if her husband was really UK permanent resident or even a citizen, there's no way Sean will not have their baby in the UK. Because if Sean delivers in the UK, through the sponsorship of her man, her baby will get peppers. Why going to Nigeria? This is fact. This is something that she shared here. She did a video that they were traveling to Nigeria to go have their baby. And that was what happened. That was what I reacted on here. Did I insult her? No. So let them bring it on. Anything you have shared here, I have right to talk about it, to react to it and give my opinion. We are not disturbing anybody here. Who do we have next? Hey, the Marawas. Oh my goodness. Mega, mega shout out to everybody out there helping the Marawas to get their free bee things. Jamaica Uncle. Hey. Our manager was crying for Jamaica Uncle. Jamaica Uncle, you didn't warn whoever that was recording this. Get it back. You didn't tell him to edit it out that your wife will fight you like nothing. You didn't tell them, Jamaica uncle. Jamaica uncle actually behaved himself. He didn't pay attention to the manager. He's so awkward, so... F Guys, have you ever seen anything like this? You're crying for someone's husband. Hey, there's a message, actually. The, the truth of the matter is, there's a message for our manager to be crying because of Jamaica uncle's living. It means that there's something beneath. There's something that they didn't share with us. Tell me why she couldn't control herself. Tell me what will make her this emotional. Crying, crying. She was red for me that the other guy was like, oh, what's going on here? But before we go to that side, let's move to South Africa. The Virginia made it to South Africa, Mzanzi for sure. He is in Cape Town and he met up with this little girl. Aha. I'm looking at this girl. I'm asking, is this one not an adult in a baby body? Eh? The way this girl comports herself, the way she spoke, the way she took Davo Junior around. Davo Junior was actually intimidated. Davo Junior didn't know what else to say. Rather than saying, oh, I gave her my bracelet forever. 
She is my friend. Who is your friend? They're minor. That was junior. Hey, be very careful. I know the family is nice to you. I know they are in the background, probably even the one recording you guys, but you still got to be careful. But that little baby again, cutie, 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 free like air, very, very free and welcoming. Happy to have the original. Seems that they are really into the marrowers, like they watch the marrowers. This little young chap even knows the Mwango, you know, meaning that they are very familiar with the marrow. Guys, hey, let me even shocktalize you guys. Davujinio's host is from where? Nigeria. The lady is Nigeria. <laughs> hey, what happened to Mr. Kenge when he was in Yankee? He was hosted by a Nigerian. Did the same thing in Europe. Of course, a Nigerian guy assisted her around. She ended up being so sarcastic. She ended up insulting the guy, like looking down on this guy. They always get help. They know how to use people. They always get help from West Africans. But at the same time, they will come and talk nonsense about West Africa. Oh, these guys. So oh, I, I don't think I want to get close to them. I don't think I will even want to visit their country. Oh, I feel so sorry for those ones from West Africa. Oh, they are the only ones like this on this internet. Go report them. Make sure you delete this channel. Oh, we are going to take them down. They cannot stop us from having GoFundMe even for useless stuff. Oh, we need to surprise an audience and take him or her to her dream vacation. We must ask for GoFundMe. Oh, bringing Afro Indians, which never happened. Go from me. 10,000 USD. Donate, 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 donate. Anybody that goes against this, we must take that person down. And people are supporting this. Like as we speak, people are still supporting this. Support whoever you want to support, but stand with the truth. Call a spade a spade. Condemn your person if he or she has done something wrong. Direct that person. Educate him or her. That is why we are here, guys. We cannot sit here and let these things happen. Let's watch that Virginia. Vibe right now is so beautiful. Oh, oh damn. Look at it. Look at all the flowers. We're literally in autumn. And it looks like it's spring. Wow. Look at all these flowers. They're so blue. It's all amazing. the trees are supposed to be cut off. Like, mm -hmm. It's so beautiful. Very beautiful, guys. Very beautiful. This Verde Club, mm -hmm. um, it has a special touch. Mm -hmm. So in autumn, the leaves doesn't change color at all. It stays green, mm -hmm. but you might see um, different colored leaves on the floor. Wow. Like these ones. See you guys. The video ooh, till the end. And sure give it a like, subscribe to the channel because that's the best way to support. <laughs> Wow, guys, and I decided to gift her my bracelet right here for good, you know, for memories, you know, yeah. right there. All right, guys, let's head inside as I take you along. I hope you're enjoying the video, and uh, yeah, let's do this. Let's yeah. do this let's go. as the queen. So, this is our Red Club new house. Mm -hmm. We will be giving you a tour at the end of the video. So. All right, guys, let's do this. Let's open. Lock the gate. Alright. And let's go inside. Sure. So you guys, we are going inside right now. That's my room. Right there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you guys can see the interior. The house is beautiful. The is beautiful. Nice. Wow. So right now we are gonna play the challenge first. Let's go. I'm trying to see Hi! Hi. This is Dr. Kenny are watching for uh -huh. this is the egg fish. It's really nice, really juicy. You see you guys, this is egg fish. There you go. You love it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Very easy. So I will get this. My oh my! This girl really impressed, impressed, impressed me. Like I can't believe that this is a young girl. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm like my jaw dropped. I'm looking at her. Her accent and everything, I'm like, eh, this girl, there's no way she's more than 10 years. Probably she's even 8, 9, or 10, but I don't know. But is the Virginia enjoying his time in South Africa? He is. Will he be 
this nice to people? Will he welcome people like this? That Virginia in particular, no. Mr. Kenge probably will do to some extent. Of course, you have to bring something. <laughs> hey, collateral, you understand? You bring in something. With. What did that Virginia present to this Nigerian family? I haven't seen it any. Of course, social climbers. What do you think? That Virginia made it to South Africa. Again, we can tell that he's preparing for his European tour. There's no way he will, being the first time he's leaving Kenya, there's no way he will jump ahead and start applying for Schengen visa, European visa, or these other places, okay? He has to start from around Africa. And from Kenya to South Africa, I think it's visa free. Like, they don't need to go to South Africa with visa. So it's actually easy for him to travel to South Africa free be free accommodation free food what would they get in return this the virginia's host what they will get is publicity that wouldn't last it will not even take the moment the virginia is out of cape town or out of south africa are you sure the audience will continue supporting the family i doubt it i freaking doubt it even Marwa's people are like that. The moment Marwa is gone, or the one go the same thing. The moment they are not with their person, nobody cares about the host. Now they are very happy. Oh, thank you for hosting the Virginia. Oh, we appreciate this. We are present here, the Virginia. She is my friend. We want to bring her to South Africa. And that 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 they like to use people. They know how to use people. They know how to finish people like this, knock people up and down. Guys, can we watch the manager shedding tears for someone's husband? I really yeah. support. Don't cry. I know, I know I you. Really you also. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I'm telling you, man. I'm, I'm a self man. And it's coming like I, I know you for, for a year. For a year. For a year. Yeah, no, I'm here to meet you. I'm going to say for anything to soon. And I know oh. people go. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I just picked up soon. Bye, man. Yeah, man. Bye. 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 Safe journey, safe journey. I need to appreciate for supporting us. Zeno Chimara. One love, one love. Few hours to come. Yo guys, so after sending Uncle to Migori, so we want to back home. Want to back home to Ayamaro Villa Melijim. Then you can see one, two, three there from Ayamaro. Because guys, you know my boss Mara is not around, so he can take care. For everything guys is going well from Villa Medellin. So if manager stop it now. Ha! <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I said, what am I seeing? Am I seeing double or what? <laughs> we have said it here. I told you guys that I noticed the move as soon as Jamaica uncle arrived in the villa. I noticed that of course manager was too much, too much interested in Jamaica uncle. And I know why Jamaica uncle was not returning back the vibe you understand because he's a married guy so he knows his wife is watching or oh, we don't know but if you know you know this girl took jamaica uncle to her people jamaica uncle met her parents and after a while i haven't noticed anything only for me to see her crying because jamaica uncle was leaving okay he was nice to you probably gave you a few things Gitriba was also crying, but I can understand because at least Gitriba got thick pocket. Gitriba got 1,000 USD. And guys, nobody needs to tell me that that money is not with Gitriba. Gitriba actually gave that money. When Jamaica uncle gave Gitriba the money, he gave it to Rururu. And I can bet you that they haven't returned that money to Gitriba. What they will do is they will tell Gitriba, Hey, Gitriba is so shameless, so useless. He lost his wife, lost his family because of Mr. Kenge. Hear him, my boss is not around. We have to make sure that everything is going on. Who are you? Who are you exactly? What are you still doing there? Guys, I feel sorry for those horses because ever since the guy, the horse guy that looks after the horses, ever since this guy left, I can tell you that assistance manager is not coping. 
Only Mashubo cannot manage with those horses. Actually, the way they are going to cut grasses for the horses shouldn't be like this. It shouldn't be something. Okay, once in a while, maybe if in the morning or if they have a schedule, they should let those horses work. They should let those horses exercise and move around and get something, at least get their own stuff. Not all the time people must go to the bush, cut grasses for them. The house manager that I told you that our congressman of God, the one I spotted, Jamaica uncle, the video that he shared, his farewell video, I took note that the house manager was the one, you know, taking care of the cows, cutting the grasses for the cows, to feed the cows. And we know that this is more like the job that Congress dad would do. So what happened? Why is Congress dad not taking care of the cows? Rather, they left it with this young girl that they just brought to the villa. Why is she the one doing this? The Michael uncle was like, oh, do you know that some other people will say that they will not do this, that this is a job for a guy? Of course, I'm not expecting her to do the house chores, look after Congress mom, look after the house, cook, clean, sweep the compound, and at the same time, take care of the cows. Hello, baby official is another guy that they are using the way I don't understand. Hello, works. Hello, baby officials was kicked out from the villa. Roro kicked him out. He used to be a gate man there. Roro drove him away, okay? But you go to their main house. He is the one still there. He's the one being used. Cong Congress mom will not call hello, baby official. Find out what happened between them. See if it's something that she can resolve, at least to allow Hello Baby to go back to his work. Whether he's getting paid, me, I don't know. Probably he's there for his YouTube growth. <laughs> Congress mom would rather bring Hello Baby sufficient over to the men villa and be using him to look after the animals, using him to grab the fruits from the tree, using him for her own gain. Using him for errands, go do this for me. That would you know the same thing. They use this guy, use this guy. What does he gain from the marrowers? Nothing. Humiliation. Abuse. Just like Uncle Mo. Till now, Uncle Mo is still being used. I'm very, very sure that even the firewood that was laying everywhere, probably Uncle Mo and Hello Baby Official. Any hard level, those kind of guys are the ones to run it. They are the ones to do the hard labor. And of course, with the nanny. And then these guys will come and brag to us. Oh, I work hard. Oh, nasty, nasty. Shut up. You always talk about, oh, despite the challenges. Oh, I don't know why Nasto will never stop feeling like people are against him for nothing. If someone is pointing finger at you, there's something that person has seen. Probably you are not seeing it. You are very nasty. For example, Jamaica uncle is living. We know quite well that he received camera, okay? CCTV camera from Jamaica uncle. And other stuff that we don't know in the background, okay? Now, this guy is living and he did collaboration with Jamaica uncle. What prevented Nasto from sharing this guy on his community? Why? He will not tag him. He will not share his link. He will not share anything. But... You are collaborating. What kind of a stingy guy is this? You talk about it, hear him. Oh, despite the way they come against us, we use that as a stepping stone. Keep using it as a stepping block because you have never changed. You will keep stepping on that block. You are actually blocking yourself. You think you are gaining. You think it's all about gain, 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 gain. You only care about yourself. Very selfish human being. Let's watch him. Because when I look back from where I came from and where I am, I say it's uh, been God's hand all through. Despite all the negativity, trust me, we don't, we don't like uh, focus on those. those. Those are like the building blocks. We really get, wherever you throw some bad words to me, I take those and say, this is a building block for Nasto. This is what makes Nasto strong. This is what makes Nasto 
move so yeah it's uh, an emotional day guys it's an emotional day again to be back in my uh, friend's uh, place here and i'm happy that uh, you guys really appreciate us and uh, really when i look back where i'm coming from of course from a taxi conductor from resigning from your job from understanding that you don't have to go for nine to five when you can beg when you can pretend when you can abandon the mother of your children and act like you are single when you can pretend and act like you are a saint when you can pretend and act like you are innocent like you don't do anything wrong eh? why why wouldn't you look back and smile when you can live on donation when you can claim that you are doing charity you go to less privileged kids you visit them visit their home go to school collect donations and you you don't give them the money you pocket everything and use it to build your own house eh? on top of it you married your girlfriend did he even marry the girlfriend abandoned the baby mama abandoned his wife his first wife you're doing all that and if you oh despite the challenges be upright and you shouldn't worry about what people think here you shouldn't worry about what the reactors yani the reactors if we are just reacting and we are not saying the truth we are lying 100 percent of what we are saying here is not true then why are you guys bothering yourselves why are you guys worried me as a reactor i don't know where i got this energy from guys as a reactor i'm not really really bothered about what other reactors have to say about me if i must talk about it i will but to bother myself now nah, to stress about it you no know, if I must address it, like I said, I will address it here because that's our job. I'm a reactor already. So if I'm reacting on other people, why shouldn't I react on my own? If there's anything I need to clear and make it straightforward and make you guys understand the truth today, of course, I will bring it here and let you know this is what this person is saying and this is actually the truth. This is actually what happened. It doesn't mean that Poco Mama is a saint. That is it. Right, let's end it with Majeke. Majeke posted a video again. I don't know whether he's trying to pull our legs like he's normally doing. I know already that he got stuff with Atrena book. I told you guys that they are marinating each other. He's trying to pretend in front of the camera looking for a wife. This is his niche. Always looking for a wife forever, ever. Did it with Dim Wango, has gone to Uganda, has gone to Nairobi. He has done a lot of stuff. Looking for what? Looking for what? I don't know which episode we are, but anyway, he went to Atrenaboke's mom because of rain, because of the noise from the background. I wouldn't want to share the clip here. He was basically ranting and yapping, saying the same thing, same old, same old, about him settling down and having a wife. Finally, with my mother-in-law. So, who is his mother-in-law? When did he marry Atrena? Did anything happen in private that would There's someone that dropped a comment under this his video. And this person actually spoke my mind. We're gonna read the comment because this is actually how I see this thing. You don't plan on falling in love. It's not something you plan. It comes naturally. You don't wake up in the morning and you'll be like, you know what? When I go out now, I'm gonna meet someone and I'm gonna fall in love with that person and we're gonna start getting married we're gonna start preparing no it falls out like that it happens naturally when you've decided to settle down with this person you may not even know i agree with this person so let's read my brother love is not planned it comes naturally off camera invite the one your heart is shimmering for on a date privately and propose to her and if it's successful, bring her back to parents and ask her and ask for their blessings, which is true. Love comes naturally. And he has claimed that he wants to keep his relationship private when he had issue with my own sister. And we saw that it was all about camera, camera. It was never real. Actually, he didn't have any intention of marrying my own sister. He never had any intention of marrying Dorina. Who is my Igno's younger sister? It was just for camera, seeking for a wife, seeking for a wife. This is his content. This is what he has been doing. Now he's acting like 
Atrena is actually the one calling Atrena's mom, mother-in-law. Whether this is for views, whether this is for clicks, which he got, he got the attention he's looking for. And people are tired of him always seeking, seeking, seeking for wife. Go ahead. You know, show people the results. Show people the outcome. And he must not come here and be, you know, bringing this lady. The Rwanda lady that came around, I think she lives in your hands right now. He also made an attempt, you know, right there. Like, tell me who does that. You're just meeting someone right there in front of the camera. You're already telling the person, no, oh, I want you to tell me if you want to be my wife. Like, putting it out there. And this girl was like, tutoring him and be like, it's a baby step. You can't expect me to tell you, yes, 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 right here in front of the camera. Anyway, they are doing all this for content. I feel like he's never serious. I don't think his audience will even take him serious anymore when it comes to him finding a wife and settling down. Because it's been on and on and on and on, back to back, back to back, looking for a wife, finding this person, going out with this person, starting up business for he did a whole lot with dorina like i almost got convinced that he was gonna marry dorina only for my own to come and open his nyash now is he going to do this with atrena to pair up with atrena because you remember what bt is saying now bt is saying that he actually planned all this their love thing for views with dk that they were never like he was never in a relationship with DK. It was all for views. He said all that. Is that what Majake is now planning to do? Since the views these days is refusing to view, people must act movies. Ken Gilwood all the way. That's where we are. We die here. No leave, no Watch to this moment, you know who you are. You're the best. Thank you all for coming in today. Support Coco Mama. Have you liked this video? Let me allow you to shower this video drop it with the water for coco mama drop your likes drop it sharply sharply yes don't forget to subscribe to the channel yes bring someone to the table tell a friend to tell a friend about coco mama I'll see you all in my another one peace out peace out peace out bye 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 guys i can no more pretend just got on my defense they do things for the end swear you go like me